chapter 7 it is uh, java basics uh, and uh, it is uh, 10 max chapter question number one it is uh, java is object oriented programming language it is developed by sun microsystem b option question number two it is uh, java binary files are actually in the form of form call dash that is not specific to any one processor or any operating system so answer is it is its byte codes right question number three it is uh, dash code it is faster execute uh, but then it uh, does not remain machine independent and so answer is a native code question number four when the program uh, gets compiled without error compiler creates a file with the extension dash in the same directory as the source file questions answer is dot class file right then what fill fit in the third box first one it is java source files usually have a extension dot java second number it is java compile compiler it will compile the file what is in the third box right after that it will display the jvm java virtual machine right so question number fifth answer is d java bytecode file or it is it's a dot class file question number six it is uh, if the program is compiled without any error and execute it using dash and go command right so answer is c tools and go command question number seven it is uh, the rules that determines what it is allowed to be used in a language are called dash of the language right so answer is b syntax of that particular language question number eight it is uh, if the name of the class it is the call cost then the program should uh, conventionally be saved in a java source code file with a name answer is b call cost dot java right option option b question number nine it is uh, dash determines the required memory size uh, type of values range of values and the type of the operations that can be performed right so answer is a it's a data type question number 10 it is java supports dash primitive data types uh, that handles the common types of integers floating point numbers characters and the boolean values in the form of the true or false right so answer is b eight primitive data types byte short integer long float double character and boolean question number 11 it is in java the dash are the machine independent uh, this means that they can be railed on their size and the characteristics uh, to be con uh, consistent across all the java programs on all machines right so answer is a all the data types question number 12 which of the following uh, rule it is incorrect while defining a variable name question number 12 answer is b it must begin with the percentage sign and question number 13 it is this uh, the name used for constant value it is known as dash right so it is also called the literals question number 14 dash numbers use only the digits 0 through the 7 in the java the numeric literals with a leading 0 it is uh, interpreted as an octal number so answer is b octal question number 15 it is uh, java supports dash type of commands right so the three types of commands then uh, dash commands begin with the double slash right and extend it till the end of the line right so answer is b single line question number 17 dash commands begin with the slash and the asterisk and end with the asterisk and the forward slash so answer is uh, a it is multi-line command question number 18 it is uh, uh, comments uh, type of comments begin with the forward slash double asterisk and end with the asterisk and the forward slash so answer is c document it is in the documentation comment type question number 19 a dash 
is used when there are many alternative actions to be taken depending upon the values of the variable or its expression right so answer is it is the switch statement right question number 20 which of the following it is a type of looping construct in the java programming right so it is all of this for loop all to while and the do while loop right so answer is d question number 21 it is the day statement it is used uh, to transfer the control outside the switch or the loop structure right so answer is d break question number 22 in a loop dash statement it is used to exit the loop and right? answer is d break statement question number 23 it is dash of the same or the different type can be nested in the java right so answer is a loops question number 24 it is if the programmer wants to control which loop to break and which loop it is to be uh, reintended dash can be used right so answer is b label loop then question number 25 it is to use the label loop for add the label followed by dash before the loop right so answer is b colon question number 26 dash independent uh, uh, independence is a program capability of being move easily from one computer system to another answer is d platform question number 27 at the dash level java primitive data types have consistent uh, size across all the development platforms answer is c source question number 28 the java program should have at least one dash and it must have the main dash in it next right, so answer is c class and its method question number 29 it is uh, the java source file can be created using any plain dash text editor right so answer is c any ascii text editor question number 3030 then java dash files files are given the same names as the class defined with an extension of java right so answer is c source file question number 31 it is uh, if class name is call cost then file name should be dash right so answer is c right call cost here there is a mistake so call c is capital c c a w l c o s t and as it is right so uh, answer is c right but there is a correction in this uh, c option right call c is capital okay question number 32 uh, in dash the java interpreter is called by simply using java answer is a jdk java development kit question number 33 the text enclosed within dash are commands right so answer is uh, b forward slash asterisk and asterisk and the forward slash and 34 it is uh, comments are not compiled or interpreted right and answer is given sorry here it is a blank right blanks are not compiled or interpreted so answer is comment comments okay there is uh, one another mistake Okay, question number thirty-five. Which of the following uh, are the basic Java statements uh, used within a method definition, such as main? Then right, question number thirty-five. Answer is D. All of this. Question number thirty-six. It is uh, if anything is to be remembered by the computer, there will be the requirement of dash during the program execution. It needs to be stored in the memory of the computer right so answer is a variable question number 37 which of the following it is the kind of variable in the java right answer is d 
it is uh, instance variable class variable or the local variable answer is d all of this question number 38 characters uh, are stored as dash unicode characters right so option a 16 bit unicode character sets right then 39 certain special characters have this uh, special literals that use a dash as an escape character answer is b backslash right question number 4040 the basic building block of expressions are dash uh, variables and the function called answer is a literals question number 41 how many basic primitive data types are the supported in the java programming it supports the eight primitive data types okay next equation 42 What is the default data type of the floating point literal? And the answer is D double. Question number forty-three. Which of which character set it is used for the character data type in Java? Answer is a Unicode character set. Question number forty-four. It is uh, which of the following? It is the compile error free. And the answer is here. All of this, right? Then question number forty-five. Which of the following it is not allowed as the first character in the valid variable name? Answer is B. Digit. Question number forty-six. Which of the following is not a basic data type in Java? Answer is D. String. Question number forty-seven. This which of the default value of the boolean data type? Right. So answer is the C. False. Question number forty-eight. What will be the result of arithmetic expression seven divided by two? Right. Answer is B. Three point five. Question number next forty-nine. What will be the result of the arithmetic expressions minus seven modulus two? Right. So answer is B minus one. Question number fifty-five zero. What will be the result of arithmetic expressions minus seven point five modulus Two. So answer is uh, B minus one point five. 